everybody and welcome to the May 2024 Toil official unboxing video. My name is Karen, I'm the founder of Toil and I'm going to talk you through all the products in this month's box and why I chose them. The box is worth £110 and it is Best of British. Why? Because I really wanted to celebrate all those amazing brands in the UK that work so hard. I can't tell you how hard the founders work. They are just amazing. They're always trying to innovate, always trying to bring us new products that are exciting, that are good, that are great. And I think I found some best in class for you. So should we crack on and I'll show you what we've got? Right, we're going to start with my first product. This is a brand we've never had in the box before, but this is a bestseller and it's so timely for this time of year. I thought you'd really love it. And it is this. It is Hello Sundays, the one that's a serum, SPF 45. Now, a couple of things about this. I really love this product because you and I, on our face, we really should be going for something 45 to 50. It, I, I, when I was out at Cosmoprof, you know, the Italian show I went to, I spoke to a dermatologist and they, I was saying, difference between 30 and 50 isn't much. What do you think? He said, always go 50 if you can. This is 45, so it's pretty good. There's very little difference between the coverage of this and an SPF 40, 50. But what this has got is it's got serum ingredients in it as well. And that's why it's called the one that's a serum. Now, this retails at £22. So Hello Sunday is a British brand. And this product includes hyaluronic acid and vitamin C, as well as SPF 45 and top quality UVA coverage. Now, let's just unpack all of that. So the hyaluronic acid, I can't even say that, can I now? Um, that's going to retain moisture in the skin. The vitamin C is going to brighten and give your skin a little bit of radiance. The SPF is going to protect your skin from sun damage and the UVA is going to protect the lower layers of your skin from skin damage. So the UVA is the thing that penetrates skin and can cause the signs of aging. Uh, you know, fine lines and wrinkles is really what I'm saying. So that's why I wanted you to use this. Now, SPF, as you know, and I know you know this because you apply every day, don't you? Um, should normally be the last thing you apply either before you finish or before you put makeup on. So if you're not wearing makeup, SPF is the top layer. If you're wearing makeup, then SPF is the last skincare layer before you go on to makeup. So how does this work? Because this is a serum and traditionally serums go underneath moisturiser. So my tip, and actually it's one from the brand, so I'm going to claim that it's mine, but really it's the brand's. Um, is that you mix this with a bit of moisturiser and then you pop it on. Now, here's the thing about SPF and my mate works in the, in the SPF industry and I've been doing a lot of research on SPF because I want to I want to create my own SPF for you, which we'll talk about later in 2026 when it's out, when it's ready. It's, it's not going to be ready for two years. Isn't that amazing? That's how long it takes. Um, getting back to this one, you need a fair old dollop. So don't be mean. So I've seen um, skin moisturisers where it says use a small amount. It's not strictly true. Really, you should be using quite a lot of SPF and actually it should be quite hard to you know, get it all into your skin. So that, a whole pipette is what I would use. A whole pipette and then I would mix it with my moisturiser. So I'd literally on the back of my hand, mix it in and then I'd put it on my face and that's how I would make that work. So that is, I'm just gonna rub that into both hands because I'm gonna demonstrate another product now and I'm gonna have it everywhere, aren't I? Um, if you're new to these videos, they're not as professional as they could be. It's much more at home. Should we go with at home? Um, so anyway, so that's the product. So that is a product. It smells of nothing. It's fragrance free. So it's good for sensitive skin as well. So that's the first one I want you to try. Hello Sundays. Have I got that the right way up? I have. Oh, that's a miracle. Hello Sundays, SPF 45. The one that's a serum. £22 that retails at. Now we're going on to one of my favourite brands. I can't help it. Um, I'm just going to do it. And it is multi award winning. It's round the corner from me. I really love this brand. And of course it is Temple Spa and it is Repose. And this is their best selling award winning night cream. Now Temple Spa won six gold awards at the Beauty Bible Awards in 2023. And that was just one set of awards they won. They've won pretty much all the awards I can think of. Um, for different products, but this is award-winning in its own right, as is the Hello Sunday's SPF Serum, and that is why I wanted you to try it. It's just a really lovely night cream, and the thing about it is it's made for soothing and calming, and it is packed with oils. So the kind of oils it's got in it are frankincense, geranium, vetiver, um, lavender. It's got a little bit of hops in it. Um, there's something else I can't remember that's in it as well, I'm going to say chamomile, but really beautiful, soothing oils. And it's very lightly fragranced, but 
I've seen so many reviews on this and I know we've had a few Temple Spa products, but I've seen so many reviews. This is the last one for a while because this is just such a rich, nourishing cream, which is exactly what you and my skin needs at night. It needs those humectants. It needs that richness of the, so it needs the humectants and the water to uh, hydrate. It needs the oils to soften our skin. And that is what this is packed with. And that is why I wanted you to try it. Very easy to apply. I would apply it personally. I would apply it from the decolletage up. I'd massage it up here. I'd then massage it out. And then I'd massage it up around my face. I do circles around here. I do round and in. I never I never go that way out because that's making the fine lines look a little bit worse. So I massage it in, gently doing around the eye area. A little bit of like this up and down the forehead. Massage it in, go to sleep. That's how I do that one. Right, now I'm going to move on to two more exciting products. And this one, I, you know I love this brand. Uh, it's, it's run by two sisters in Manchester. And this is Code Beautiful. And we've got one of their more unusual products. We've got FFL. Is that, is that FFL? Yes, it is. Sorry, I looked at the packaging and the packaging is different to the one I've got upstairs. I might have kept mine a bit too long. Um, and this is FFL. Now, Cove Beautiful is created by Emma and Sarah Cross and they're up in Manchester. And they started this a few years ago. And how they started it was they both love makeup. They had completely different jobs, but they couldn't find a mascara that really worked for them. So what they did is they got a selection of mascaras off the counter, mushed them all together and then they um, found that they could create the perfect mascara by getting four or five mascaras together which was not terribly practical they decided so what they thought as an experiment they were going to make their own mascara so they started on that journey and then it became a whole journey into makeup but it's a really unusual range um they you know they wrote there's only one color of mascara there's only a few colors of lip products there's only three concealers uh, things like that. It's just, it's just a really interesting range. But what they did is they strive for excellence. Now, the product I've got you here is called Forget Fake Lashes. And before you think, oh my goodness, I'm going to like Widow Twenky, that's not the point of the product. The point of the product was it's a cross between a, ser a lash serum in terms of the results and fake lashes. Lash serums, what they do is they feed chemicals into your into your into your um, follicles of your of your eyelashes in order to make them grow a little bit longer and a little bit thicker. This doesn't do this. What this does is it conditions your existing lashes and just makes them longer by adding a few little fibres on the end. But it's contact lens friendly. This so it was not going to drop into your eye. So basically, if you look at it, hang on, the product you can see it's a little bit, it's just a bit kind of whitish brownish really um but basically you apply a coat of it before you apply a mascara so the technique that sarah tells me about is called wiggle oh, let me let me just undo this again it's called wiggle and roll wiggle and roll i can't go it i can't do that i've tried i really have tried sarah i can't do it so don't worry if you can't either just apply it like you would mascara Leave it to dry a little bit, about 30, 60 seconds, not more. You know, do your cheeks or something else while you're doing that. And then pop your mascara over the top and you will see your lashes thicker, denser and longer. This has conditioning ingredients as well, so it's good for you. And I can't say that about all lash serums. I don't love all lash, lash serums, which is why we, we haven't ever had one in the box. I haven't found one I love enough to, to give you. Um, but I do really like this. And I think you'll find the effect of it, because quite often as we get older, our eyes start moving backwards in our sockets. I don't need to say that. It's not a nice thing to think about, is it? But they do. So what you're going to do is you're going to get your, your eyes moving back. So you need to open your eyes up as much as you can. And my lashes are getting um, shorter these days. I don't know how. And this just really helps it keep that length and keep that openness. And I think if you've never tried this and you're looking at it and going, no, no, I don't want to. Honestly, try it. You will be astounded at what this can do. It's just a brilliant, brilliant product. And everyone will go, oh my goodness, have you got lashes on? Oh, you know, what mascara are you using? All that kind of stuff. It's not necessarily the mascara. Any mascara can go over this. It's just this. So this retails at £22. I'm so sorry, I forgot to say this retails at £46. Um, £22, so that's that. And then the final product I've got is one we've never had in the box. Leslie Thomas said, and she was the ex-beauty director of The Times, um, she said, if you're going to support one British beauty brand, it should be this one. It's also been named by Indian Knight, who I think writes in, I'm going to go the Times as well. She said, this is the God of all things in category. 
And if you've never used one of these, once you get into midlife, it is a go-to product. And I'm gonna show you two different ways to use it. And it is by the incredible Ruby Hammer. And it is Ruby Hammer's eyeliner. Now, why do you want this? Right, let, before we get to that, let's talk about Ruby Hammer. So Ruby Hammer is a makeup artist. She has done everyone. She's done, I mean, who do you want to talk about? All the supermodels, um, most of the key actresses of our time, Sienna Miller, any anyone you think about, the list is on her website. It's just enormous. Tom Hanks, if you really want to know, she's done Tom Hanks as well. Not necessarily relevant to you or me, but she has done him. Um, so those are the kind of circles she moves in. She also started the beauty brand Ruby and Millie, which you might remember, it used to be in Boots. Um, and then some sort of hoo-ha happened. Didn't go into that, don't need to know. Um, and so she had to, she left her brand and so she decided to start her own brand. And she started with a very few products. And one of them is this eyeliner and it's a really unusual eyeliner, so it's black. It's a, they're, all, they're always black. Look how tiny that pencil is. That is tiny compared to a normal pencil. There are two ways you can do this. And the reason we're doing this is to define the eye. And it's again about hooded eyes. It's about the eyes going back in the socket. It's pulling that eye forward. And I want to give your face a little bit more definition. I use an eyeliner every single day. Every time I do my makeup, I use it. And I am rubbish at using eyeliners. So I can't get that beautiful straight line. I can't get the flick. I can't get any of it. So let's have a look at how we're going to do this. We, we can do two things. We can do a straight line. Now, how I do the straight line is I would I would always pull. You don't have to. I've seen websites that say don't pull. So there's two is, and then I'd kind of feather it along that lash line and I'd feather it because I can't get it a straight line otherwise. Now, once I've got that line on there, I, I can see that there's always going to be, because I'm rubbish at it, there's always going to be a gap between the lash line and my eyelid, which looks kind of, you know, different colour to, to the liner. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take a Q-tip, I'm just going to blend it in and soften that line. And honestly, it makes the world of difference, the world of difference. The second way you're going to use this, and please don't worry, I'm going to do a whole video on this separately where I've not got eye makeup on in the first place. The second way you can use it is you can take the pencil, you can look up, and then you can dab it, I hope I'm not gonna, between the lashes, it doesn't even look like there's a line there, but it'll pull the eye forward. And you'll realize it just looks way more defined and, and soft and beautiful. It looks really pretty. Just dab the pencil between the lashes, but you have to do it from underneath, if you know what I mean. You have to kind of look up and then do it there. Honestly, it makes such a difference. It's so, such a brilliant thing to do. These retail at 18 pounds and I'm just absolutely thrilled we've got it in the box. Try it, play with it. Makeup is play. And that's what I want you to do. I want you to play with some of these products, try them, see what you think. So that is your May box you've got in it. You've got your Ruby Hammer and this is hugely award-winning. It's been called the God of all things in terms of eyeliners and eye pencils. So I really want you to try that. You've got your Forget Fake Lashes, which is um, brilliant instead of a lash serum. It's an alternative to a lash serum in terms of it gives you instant results and makes your lashes look longer. It's not going to make them grow, but it will make them look longer and feel beautiful and feel fuller. You've then got your Temple Spa Repose Night Cream, which is £46. And then you've got your, oh, hang on, I'm going around. You've got your Hello Sunday SPF 45 worth £110. That is your May 2024 box. Best of British. I really hope you enjoy using those products.